everyone, welcome to Snowy Bangles. This is the channel all about my Bengal cats. And I am just the human that comes on here to give you an introduction and give you some context on what you are about to watch. So this is actually part two. Part one will be linked down below, but in part one, you saw me transform this remote control car toy into a cat toy. And when I say I transformed it, I just tied a shoelace to the back of it, but it really did transform it. My cats love it. They seem to love the car and the string. So it's been a win-win situation. But if you did watch part one, and again, I don't wanna give it away because I want you to still watch part one because it's a fun time. But in part one, the car still gave me some issues. It was cheap, you know, it was affordable, but it was also cheap. <laughs> so. I am still determined to make it work. So I'm gonna hop off because I'm not as cute as my Bengal cats. You came here to watch fluffiness, I understand. So keep watching, learn more, and subscribe to Snowy Bengals. The problem, oh my goodness, Kitty, you're in the shot. The problem is driving me crazy. So one part of me thinks maybe it has to do with the batteries because we weren't for sure if like they were used or not. It literally just makes me so sad for them because they'll be having a blast and then this will stop working. And a part of me thinks it has to do with the frequency. I know you guys are probably thinking like, oh, well, why don't you just take the car outside and play with them there? My Bengal cats are indoor cats. I have no idea how they would react going outside. And once they experience the outdoors, they may not enjoy the inside. I don't really know what to do, but what I can do is check the battery power. It's in the green. In the green again. This one's also in the green. Still technically in the green. A possible third issue is that when I slide these in, they're able to move around and they're losing their connection that way. Okay, I'm sorry. Percy says I'm being really boring about this, but I want to figure it out. And I know you do too. <sighs> I literally used the cardboard from a battery pack. I think I found the solution. A ping pong ball. Maybe that needs to be the lazy cat mom go-to. They've been playing with it all morning. Okay, they look like they're not. <laughs> I think they're tired. Oh, oh, no, see? Peep kitties. Here, I can get it. Let me toss it for you. Yeah, you ready? I see the car has been untouched. Are you totally over the car? What is it with you kitties? You were so obsessed with it and now that the camera is on you, you're acting like you're too cool for it. Are you too cool? Oh my gosh. Good morning. Watch me be so annoying and get my cat's attention. <laughs> oh shoot, there's like a gap here. I guess I'll put you... Um... got annoyed I've been doing that like five times in a row <laughs> oh, 
Okay. <laughs> They're bored of me, and I look bad, so I'm gonna go. Hey, Nikki. Did you lose your ping pong ball? I know, I tried to look for it and I couldn't find it. Will you point out where it is? If you show me, I'll get it out. Oh, don't be sad. It's okay. It's okay, I've lost things too. Do you wanna play with the car? Okay, that's cool too. I also like to eat when I'm bored. My boyfriend and I are hanging out today and we've made the decision to open the black remote control car. The black one actually functions at a different frequency so we can both control like the red and the black at the same time and not worry about interference. Very sweet. Here is the remote. Oh my gosh. Wait, look how bent they moved with the antenna, how they packaged it. This time we're not going to mix batteries. We're going to use all energizer. And fun fact, my boyfriend actually did a science experiment to see if energizer was the leading battery brand. And it was just like every other battery. And Nikki is watching. There is a kitty too I see under here. Which one is this? Oh, jeez. I had no idea Percy's was under there the entire time. Uh oh. Wait. Are you moving it? Oh, you have to. Is it working? Oh, you have to do both <laughs> at the same time? Yeah, it kind of makes it difficult, but it's there fun to make it twirl around. Should we attach a string to it? <laughs> I'm wounded. Want me to fix it? That's what's kind of bad about this. What's happening, kitty? Oh, Percy's going for it. Go, Percy's. Get that string. you've seen the footage yet of the red car and it does work really well like it's first half hour for sure but that is quick really quick I get the black car you get the red car it doesn't work <laughs> see the red car didn't have enough speed and traction to go up over that metal ledge let's see oh wait oh I'm not even pushing the trick button and it's going so fast. I'm gonna try again. <laughs> it's powerful though. We've determined that the black car is much faster, but because of that, it's harder to control. It's always doing wheelies. It just won't drive normal. And when it crashes into things, it has so much momentum, it flips over like a turtle on its back. I think it'd be a lot more fun to play with outside, but again, my cats are indoor cats. And now, since I have like full on Energizer pack, I'm replacing the batteries in this car and seeing if the issue was just I needed battery continuity. Wait. Whoa, that's... 
the batteries were the issue. <laughs> this is literally part two that I'm filming. And on part one, I was just judging this car on defective batteries. <laughs> Don't mix batteries. <laughs> And now they also get <laughs> a lot more tangled in the shoelace. And it makes it harder too, because you can't chase the cats with it, which I told you guys in the beginning, like I wasn't going to do, but I think they actually kind of like being chased. And because it's harder to control, you can't just make it easily go and do loops around the house for them to be entertained to chase the string. Nonetheless though, I don't know, I, I still find myself happy about it, but I think, <laughs> This is not the perfect solution for the lazy cat mom, and I'm still on that journey. So just subscribe now. We're going to figure this out. I'm going to save you time and money and finally come up with the perfect homemade cat toy. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.